Hi folks, Skip here again from Woodworking UK and you are watching Skip's Tips. Uh, one thing I've got for you here is uh, how to make a, a new piece of wood. I've got a new piece of wood there all square and planed up, look old, give it some, uh, you know, some ageing. What I've got here, piece of chain, scrap of, what's that, 18mm, 15mm plywood, it was just a scrap, with some screws randomly shoved through it. Right, I'm just alter the camera and then come back to you. So, all I do with this, whack it in, then stick it on the end, put a bit of pressure on it, and drag that across your wood. Do it a couple of times if you like, depending on what sort of look you're looking for. What it does, they look like little worm holes then, the little uh, holes from the end of the screws, and your scratches look like little splits in your wood, but they're not actually split, it's only going a, a mil, maybe two mil deep. Take your piece of chain, I'd, I'd double it up, twice the impact like that. Give it a belt, you can't really see it now, but when you wax that up, You'll see what I mean. Okay, so I've done that. I've got my uh, orbital sander with some, I think that's 120. Yeah, 120 grit in it. When, you, when you're bashing it up, it just raises the grain a little bit around the uh, around the splits and the knots. So, literally, that's it. Just a quick wrap over just to take them little burrs off the edge of the wood. Although, don't want to do it too much, otherwise, you're going to sand them out because they're really shallow. Okay? Okay, so now I'm going to put a bit of finish on that, just a bit of uh, bit of wax here. Give it a rub on. Make sure you get it in there and all the... I've gone a bit mad there, we're dragging that... Uh, dragging that paddle across. Put quite a lot of split... well, they're not splits, but quite a lot of the split effect in there. You see what happens? You put that wax on there. Get a clean bit of cloth. Give that a buff. See how that looks like an old, you know, piece of, almost like barn wood. Now, this just doesn't work with wax. This is uh, some brie wax that I'm using here. I love using brie wax. It's really good stuff. Uh, but you put stuff like uh, your coal on wood dye. Well, any wood dyes. Coal on wood dye. I like to use Wilco's own brand wood dye. Any wood dyes on there, you put it on and it does get in the, in the scratches and the little holes to uh, make them stand out more. Same with any finish. I've, I've tried this with loads of different finishes. It seems to work with everything. Obviously, if you're painting it or something like that, not, not so good, but staining it, waxing it, oiling it, everything like that, just makes it look nice and old look. There's lots of other ways of uh, adding age to wood, but that's just one of the ones that I use. Okay, folks, so that's it for me for now. If you've not seen the uh, Facebook page, check us out. Search Facebook for Woodworking UK. Uh, myself or one of the other admin team will approve your membership. Okay, thanks a lot, folks.